well, that's not the only fun event going on. We can visit Lauderdale's Walk and Roll Restaurants announced. Visit Lauderdale is no or yes, visit New Lauderdale is known for its party life, scenic seashores, and delicious wine and dine options. To add more bliss to this gourmet paradise, Visit Lauderdale is announcing the opening of Walk and Roll, Greater Fort Lauderdale Food and Wine Festival's Asian Street Food Music Experience. Curated by two happy Buddhas, the restaurant will be inaugurated on January 11th at 6.30 p.m. at Backyard in Fort Lauderdale. The event is strictly for those 21 and above. The restaurant lineup for the inaugural walk and roll will include Baoshi, Jeepney, Krakatawa, Lutong Pinoy, Miso, Japanese Tapas, Two Korean Girls, which is a restaurant, Red Pine, Sweet Aloha Ice Cream, Temple Street Eatery, and Zuru Ramen Bar. I'm so hungry now. <laughs> this cultural experience will highlight Asian cuisine and culinary artistry throughout Broward County. And don't forget, a portion of all proceeds go to the Joe DiMaggio Children's Hospital. You can be part of this event. Tickets are only $70. Further information is available on Visit Lauderdale's website. Visit Lauderdale, everyone under the sun. He's awesome. Uh, I'll tell you, the great thing about this is it's going to expose people, even residents here, to a food scene that they might not be fully aware of. I mean, we all know because of our proximity, we have great uh, Mexican food, Latin American food, uh, even a few British specialties have come over from people who decided to settle here from Europe, but we're not really well known for our Asian cuisine. And we've got some really good Asian cuisine in Broward County. So this is going to be a great way to spotlight this. And of course, with Visit Lauderdale overseeing it, mm -hmm. kiss. Well, Fort Lauderdale doesn't have a Chinatown. I mean, all yeah, the other true. cities in which they've lived, you know, Chicago, Boston, DC, they all have Chinatowns. So this is like having our little own little Chinatown now. Mm -hmm. Well, I love Wilton it. Wilton Drive's got a lot of Asian restaurants. Yeah. I mean, mm -hmm. we're not yeah. shy on TJ's. TJ's. TJ's is fantastic. Tie me, tie, uh, tie me up. Yeah. Um, sushi, uh, sushi. Not, is, there's another one. Sushi Geisha Girls. Is, is Geisha. 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 Geisha is great. So we've got some great restaurants right on Wilton Drive. If you're not willing to go to the big party, you can spend <laughs> the same $70 and enjoy Wilton Drive at some of these Asian restaurants. Yeah, I was excited to see uh, Krakatoa is a restaurant in downtown yeah. Hollywood. Um, their um, LGBTQ um uh friendly owners and um great amazing food and as you pointed out a lot of vegetarian mm -hmm. options for people who yeah. don't um eat meat and um love to see our our local they actually started kind of good story about them they started in the yellow green market in oh, yeah. in oh, hollywood, hollywood. Like, yeah. and which has become an incubator for a lot of really interesting restaurants we have two restaurants i think now or maybe three in downtown hollywood that started as booths in the oh, yellow green market, wow. Krakatoa was one of them. So I've been frequenting right. them since they were in the yellow green market. I tried them. They were really good. Yeah. You said something about um, British food. Like that is a thing, and they came here with it. Would they <laughs> run out British. of town? I was, I was thinking Indian I, food. I love. Yeah. I was thinking, I was thinking, honestly, I was thinking more French and German food. Oh, okay. uh, all right. When I was thinking better. of Europe, so yeah. I was like, bangers and mash. I mean, <laughs> yeah. Uh, now, now, nothing, nothing personal. Greg, now, Greg, your husband is a is our food, critic. our culture and food writer at Out South Florida. Uh, do you think you'll be attending this? I have no doubt that we will be there. Okay, I'm, I'm sure. So. Go to that. You might see Greg and Rick. Um, you can take pictures, selfies, only $25. <laughs> $25. <laughs>